I'm going to tell you a little story that's going to make you stop and think. Reflect on the things in your life that you do have, rather than looking at those things that maybe we don't have. The story is called Flying. Once upon a time, there was a little boy who was raised in an orphanage. The little boy always wished that he could fly like a bird. It was very difficult for him to understand just why it was that he couldn't fly. There were birds at the zoo. They were much bigger than he and they could fly. Why can't I fly, he thought. Is there something wrong with me? There was another little boy who was crippled. He had always wished that he could walk and run like other little boys and girls. Why can't I be like them, he thought. Then one day, the little orphan boy who had wanted to fly like a bird ran away from the orphanage. He came upon a park where he saw a little crippled boy who couldn't walk or play in the sandbox. He ran over to the little boy and asked him, have you ever wanted to fly like a bird? No, said the little boy, who could not run or walk. But I have wondered what it would be like to walk and to run, just like other little girls and boys. That's very sad, said the little orphan boy. Do you think we could be friends, he said. Sure, said the little boy. The two little guys played for hours. They made sand castles. They made really funny sounds with their mouths. Sounds which made them laugh so very hard. Then the little boy's father came with a wheelchair to pick him up. And the orphan boy who had always wanted to fly ran over to the boy's father and whispered something in his ear. The father said, Sure, sure. That'll be okay. Then the orphan boy, who always wanted to fly like a bird, he ran over to his new friend and said, You are my only friend, and I wish there was something I could do to make you walk. But I can't. But there is something that I can do for you. The little orphan boy turned around and told his new friend, climb up onto his back. He then began to run across the grass. Faster and faster and faster and faster he ran, carrying the little crippled boy on his back. Faster and harder he ran across the park. Harder and harder he made his legs travel. Soon the wind whistled across the two little boys' faces. The little boy's father stood there and began to cry as he watched his beautiful little crippled boy flapping his arms up and down in the wind, all the while yelling at the top of his voice, I'm flying, Daddy, I'm flying. So the next time, you think about complaining about those things that you don't have a few moments and be grateful for the things you do have. I'm flying.